Let's add some neck tape binding to this Gus and Steel basic tee. The great thing about neck tape is how finished and professional it looks, and you can add it to just about any tee, hoodie, or dress that features a neckband. I've already started by attaching the neckband and top stitching down the front part of the neckband with a single chain stitch from shoulder to shoulder. Now we'll add our binding to the shoulders and the back of the neckband. I like to cut my binding at approximately one and a quarter inches wide. With the right side of the binding to the front of the seam, line up the raw edge and clip it all the way across. It can be a bit tricky at the meeting point of the shoulder seam and the neckband, so work carefully to make sure you're not pinching any extra shirt fabric into the clips. Then sew a triple stitch with a quarter inch seam allowance across the length of the binding. It's really important here to keep a steady quarter inch because you're sewing right over the edge of the previous seam. Be extra careful when you get to the junction of the shoulder seam and neckband so that you don't have any weird wrinkles or puckered fabric on the right side of the tee. Go as slowly as you need to, removing clips as you go. Now the binding is attached. Just trim off any excess on each side. Now we'll wrap our seam with the binding. Just fold it neatly over the edge of the seam and clip it in place. Time to add a tag if you'd like to. Then I like to pin the wrapped seam against the bodice in a few places. We'll sew straight across again, sewing the binding down to the bodice. If you have a different color binding than your main fabric, you may want to match your threads accordingly. Here I have a pinkish needle thread and an olive green in my bobbin. I recommend using a chain stitch, a triple stitch, or even a straight stitch if you don't need a lot of stretch to get it over the head. You'll just go slowly and carefully just inside the bottom edge of the binding. I find this easiest to do from the wrong side of the shirt, but you could try it from the right side if you like. Now you're done. Go ahead and finish your shirt as usual and enjoy your newest technique.